how's everyone doing? Today on Cooking with Jay, it's smoothie time. And I've been making a lot of smoothies lately, but one of my favorite ones to do is a really quick and easy one that you really only need two ingredients for. And that is my banana smoothie. And I just use bananas, and then I like to use Vita Coco coconut water with pineapple. It gives it just a tiny little burst of flavor right there. And I've got my the Overlook Hotel glass right there. And what I like to do is overnight I'll put a couple bananas into the freezer right there. And these should be ready to go. It makes it a more solid consistency and kind of makes it like frozen ice cream almost. And I like to cut them up a little bit. You can actually do this beforehand. I forgot to cut them up last night. And I put two ice cubes in there as well just to give it a little bit more chill to it. And I'll put a little bit of pineapple coconut water in there. I like to put the liquid in first. It usually helps to blend things easier. And that's why I chopped up these bananas. It'll be easier on the blender and just makes for a smoother blend. And I put two bananas in there, lots of potassium. And now let's go ahead and blend it up. Let's check it out. All right, there we go, I'm done blending. I had to shake it up a little bit and add a little bit more pineapple coconut water. And you can add as much or as little as you like. It depends on how thick you like your shake. But let's go ahead and pop this off. Oh yeah, that smells so freaking good. Banana-rama. And let's go ahead and pour this. Yeah, look at that. It's like banana ice cream. As you can see, it's very thick. You can even call this banana ice cream like I just said instead of a banana smoothie. But there's a little bit of liquid to it. And uh, again, I like it thick, so that's why I didn't put as much coconut water in there. But if you like, you can put more coconut water in there and that'll make it a little bit more liquidy and viscous. And as you can see, two bananas is just the right amount for this pint-sized glass. So there you go, there's the simple, easy, two ingredient recipe for banana smoothies. I put two bananas and a little bit of pineapple coconut water in there to give it a little bit of flavor uh, that's not banana. Just a, just a splash of that coconut pineapple water right there for the thickness. And you can see, look at that. Oh, so good. It's a great frozen treat and a good ice cream substitute. It's great in the morning, very invigorating, and it's also a very good snack as well. It's pretty much great all the time. I love it. Mmm. Oh, so delicious. Who needs ice cream anymore when you can have healthy smoothies like this? And it tastes incredible. So there you go, there's my banana smoothie recipe. Simple, easy, quick, and good for you, and tasty, yum-tastic. So let me know what you think of this recipe, and if you would like to see me do any other recipes on Cooking with Jay in the future, leave me a comment or a video response down below. Hope everyone's doing well. Take care. Blah, blah.